Hello everyone, here in this video I am going to show you that how you can display color variants as a separate products in your Shopify store. So on my screen you can see that I have different products but they have also the swatches which are representing that they have multiple colors. So for say example I have this pro these products and let's see this product you can see that we have red color, black color and this is another brown color and this is cream color. So how we can display all these colors as a separate product on this collection page. So I will show you step by step. You just need to follow the steps and then you can also make it happen on your collection pages. So you should go to the dashboard of the store and here you can see that I have installed prestige theme. If, if you have any other theme then you can actually explore my playlist. So I have uploaded a lot of videos for other themes as well. So firstly you should click on these three dots, click on duplicate. Once you are duplicating this theme then you can click on edit code. And here we have some folders and files so you should actually follow the documentation. I have already given the link below in the description so you need to download the uh, code and uh, these four files you will be getting firstly you should open document.txt and inside of it i have already written some steps so for example the first step is create new snippet color dash variant so you should copy this name from here and go back to the dashboard and here you should click on snippets click on add a new snippet paste that name color dash variant and then click on done then after in this empty file you need to paste the attached code which is this one here you can see color-variant.txt so open this file you should copy this complete code and paste it inside of that empty file which we have just now created then you should click on save and then close this file again go back to the documentation and here we have the second step which is create new snippet color-product-card and then paste attached code so let's copy this and create another new snippet so you should click on add a new snippet paste that name click on done and again this is an empty file so you should paste the attached code which is this one here you can see color-product-card.txt so you should open this complete file copy the complete code and then paste it inside of this empty file and then click on save once the changes are saved now it's time to render these files into our collection pages so how we can do that Again go back to the documentation we have the third step which is go to sections and open main-collection.liquid. So copy main-collection and search this file here and you will see that we have main-collection.liquid and inside of it we are going to replace something which is product-card you need to replace with color-variant. So copy product-card and search it inside of this file. So if you are searching it you will find out that it is highlighted here. So we need to replace it with color dash variant. So how you can do that? You should copy this exact color dash variant and paste it right here. Once you are done, then you can click on save. Once the changes are saved, then you can actually see the preview. So here is the uh, collection page. Let me refresh it. And here we go. Now you can see that we have all the different color uh, images here. Let's see. For example, we had uh, we had this one. We had this one last time. Can you see this was uh, white, red, and other colors? So all those colors are displaying. The red is displaying here. Can you see? Black is also displaying here, and uh, brown is also displaying, and white is also displaying. This is the cream color. So similarly, all those colors are displaying now, and. Uh, that's how you can actually make it work in your Shopify store. So if you are facing any problem or something, you can ask me directly. I will help you out in that. And you can also see like uh, the swatches are also working. So for example, I am clicking on this swatch. So this is also changing the other color. All right. So we have no problem at all. One more thing that you have to keep in mind is that you should go to the dashboard uh, again and uh, let me open any of the product. For example, I'm opening these products click on this and make sure that the color should be at the first place so right now the size is at the first place so you should move this color to the first place and another thing you need to keep in mind is that all these images should be uploaded so this should not be blank if these will be uploaded then automatically the colors will be separated on the collection pages if these are missing then the default image will be reflecting so make sure that all these images should be uh, already uploaded and color should be at the first place and then you can click on save. 
if you have any problem or something you can ask me i will help you out in that and if you have any new feature to develop you can directly contact me i have already given the contact details below in the description so i created a lot of other stores also with a lot of custom features without using any app so i can also help you if you have any new feature to develop so thank you so much for watching this video if you are new on this channel then please subscribe this channel also like this video you can also follow me on Instagram, TikTok and Facebook. You can join the WhatsApp group also. So thank you once again. See you in the next video.